Okay, so the post-NFC championship euphoria has worn off, and you're now thinking clearly about a trip to Minneapolis. Will your tickets break the bank? Well, maybe dent it, but things have actually gotten better, says Jamie Downs of Wanamaker Entertainment Group in Center City. I think LaSalle plays pennant. LaSalle. They've been a player in the secondary ticket game for 60 years. The market has, uh, has turned in favor of the buyer recently, within the last, you know, six or eight hours. A midday look at StubHub confirmed that. Nosebleed seats at U.S. Bank Stadium could be had for about 3,500 bucks apiece. On Monday, those same seats ran five grand. And the best seats were also down a couple thousand dollars apiece. What's happening? Well, for starters, Eagles and Patriots season ticket holders now know whether they won their respective lotteries and thus have access to seats at face value. So these are likely folks who maybe found out they won the lottery, they have access to the tickets, but figured they could do better by selling them than using them. Correct. Minnesota in February, not a fun place to be, right? So the ticket supply is up, and the demand? Well, think about what goes into that factor. We've seen a huge spike in hotel prices. Um, flights out of Philly are almost, you, you pretty much can't find them. And for those staying on the ground, it's an 18 or 19 hour drive from Center City, Philadelphia to U.S. Bank. Still, season ticket lottery winners have a face value ticket in hand, and that's not a bad position to be in. It's a gold mine, you know, it's like a lottery ticket. Do you use it to uh, have the experience and maybe the 50% chance that they win? Or do you use it to um, uh, turn it into cash? Turn it into cash.